And we do have an update tonight on the city's New Year's Eve celebrations, what they will look like this year. And of course, there's been some controversy surrounding it. As Mike McDaniel reports, some state leaders are now criticizing city leaders for asking Dick Clark Productions to remove Lauren Daigle from the lineup. <laughs> Just two weeks before New Orleans ushers in a new year, Mayor LaToya Cantrell is facing criticism from state leaders after requesting Grammy winner and Lafayette native Lauren Daigle not be part of the celebration. We just got to make sure we're not cutting off our nose to spite our face and we put some, some personal feelings aside. Lieutenant Governor Billy Nungesser believes personal feelings prompted the mayor to write a letter to Dick Clark Productions requesting Daigle be removed from the New Year's Rockin' Eve celebration. Nungesser says there is no signed deal for Daigle to perform, but rather a local agreement to have her sing. The mayor's request stems from an unpermitted November concert in the French Quarter, which drew hundreds of maskless people with no social distancing. Known as Let Us Worship, Daigle performed, but wasn't the organizer. Unfortunately, the participation of Miss Daigle in that Let Us Praise event uh, did not speak to the needs of this city and uplift our people as it relates to public health. State Attorney General Jeff Landry also weighed in. Landry wrote a letter to Daigle calling the mayor's actions retaliation. Nungesser says he hoped Daigle would be part of the event because of her ties to and work with Louisiana tourism. He even offered to hold the event on the West Bank, using New Orleans as a backdrop. Hopefully we'll get past it, whether the mayor does something or not. The city's communication director says the city's concern is public health. He says Thanks the city is having conversations about hosting the event safely. The New Year's Eve celebration is something that remains a priority for us. It's something that could potentially create up to 60 uh, gigs that night for locals who are professionals in the film industry. Even if Daigle doesn't perform, some type of celebration is expected. The mayor said she was going to get some local musicians to perform. I'm not sure whether she's doing it with Dick Clark or not. Mike McDaniel, Eyewitness News.